so this is another website or app that I have chosen to talk about. Um, this is called Class Craft, and it actually reminds me a lot of the our latest one of our latest discussion boards with gaming. So this is the first screen that it brings you to when you have your account. Up here, you'll see where it says Home, um, and this is your classes. So this was just the one class that I created. You can create as many classes as you want. So if you were a science teacher and you had chemistry and biology, you could create a different class for all of those if you wanted to. Um, basically, the point of this game is just to motivate kids to um, to get their work done and to have good behavior in class. So um, I tried to assign students, and I think it's going to be easier. If you go over here, it says demo class. You can actually explore the demo class, and it teaches you lots and lots and lets you kind of walk through that without um, assigning any of your own students. There's also lots and lots of tutorials off to the side that you can watch. How it works, setting up your classes and introducing students to it. When I first signed up, there was a number of videos that you could watch as well. So I'm going to go over here to the demo class and kind of walk you guys through what I saw. So over here to the left, you'll see all of your students will be listed out and you can actually go to each individual student. So each student can actually create their own character and there's so many things that they can do. So if you look here, we have HP, AP, XP, and GP. So these are basically all just um, a different number of um, coins or stars or points that they can actually receive. So um, you actually will assign these based on different things. So like HP might be for good behavior, AP might be for a good grade, and so on. So you actually will push, um, in order to assign these, you'll just push the plus sign when you push the plus sign up here, it says positive behaviors and you can create how you can completely name all this, whatever you want. And then it kind of tells you um, completing online activities and you can give them this many XP points or this many GP points. Um, all of those points actually represent um, different things. So if you close out of here um, and we go back to our student, they can buy different things with each of these points. And like I said, there's lots to it, but if you just add this plus sign, then you can go to that one screen, you can select which one you want to give either the XP or the GP points to. When you select it, it goes to them, both of those amount of points go to them. These students can actually get points for, like I said, grades, um, behaviors, and this connects to Google Classroom for those of you that use that. When you scroll down, um, it says right here, it says powers. Kids can actually use their points that they are rewarded from good behavior and good grades to buy their powers, to buy pledges, to buy certain games, um, to basically create this character and to give them superpowers. And there are games tied to this. So when you give them that free time to play that game or whatever, um, they, would, they can use their points that they earned from good behavior and from getting good grades on whatever assignments you, you would choose to do that with. So, um, like I said, we have a number of students here. And so, um, yeah, the demo class is kind of the place where you can kind of explore all of that. But like I said, all of this is set up. If you go here before you can ever even set up a class, you have to review all the behaviors. So these are your behavior choices. Um, you can kind of look through some of these. Then you also need to look through, these are the negative behaviors. So they would actually lose so many points for all of these. Um, when you actually give this to them, when you give them this feedback um, and take away those points, you can actually type out specific messages as to why they lost those points so they can see that. When you give them points, you can also type out the specific feedback as to why they received those points. So it's very one-to-one -one with each student. And I just overall, when I saw this, I thought a lot of that gaming discussion board that we did and how this would work very well for especially some of those high school kids, a great motive for schoolwork and um and just get just getting that work done and having those awesome behaviors that we look for. Um, and it's also a huge motive for them because of the gaming side of things and their ability to express themselves. So like I said, lots of components here, but this was again called Class Craft.